Melbourne system working particularly efficiently. And there are, of course, and perhaps we'll get into that if there is a tie break. There is a procedure that follows, yes. and it's quite in depth, Davide, isn't it? Yes, the tie resolution is very complicated, but I think that it will not have in this uh, in this case with so many points on the plate. And, mm. and the system that we're watching here, the round robin system, is the same. More or less will the be same in, of in the Olympics in Tokyo. The Olympics, yes. So, in some ways, this is a dress rehearsal. Yes. Of how it will unfold. Yes. So the choice of Kata for the second bout by Alexander Prati is Suprempe. And the styles of karate, the major styles, are Shitoru, which is the Suprempe kata, predominantly from, although there are other versions. Uh, so there's Shitoru, there's Shotokan, there's Wataru, and Gojoru. Yes. The origin of kata is a mix of naha, naha style, naha te, shiro te, and tamaro te. <laughs> the introductions of the styles were from the great masters of Japan. <laughs> Ichi of Funakoshi for Shotokai, for example. Yes. And Mamabuni. Suprempe, Shitoru, Gogan Yomaguchi, from Gojuru, and Hiroro Otsuka from Wadaru. So the score is for Suprempe and Alexander Rachia. Rachia takes the bow, leaves the tatami, and Dalara Bozen will come forward to perform her second kata, which is going to be Paporen. This is the third time now that we've seen this kata. And this is the version. The style has to be adhered to, doesn't it, Davide? It has to be part of the key on the of the style of the of the school of karate. But there can be slight variation, but only slight. Yes. Only slight variation that's usually you know, very, very, very small. Eh? Yeah, very yes, small. Very small. Ad they, they adapt 
sometimes the Qatar too, they, they're bad sometimes. Mm -hmm. Or some style modification during the time. But they never change the meaning of kata because every every kata has a meaning. Exactly. Has a history is a fight. Now, in the assessment of the kata, the judges are looking at technical performance, which includes the stances, the techniques, the transitional movements, and timing, the correct breathing of the athlete and the focus, the kime, about the kata, and conformance to the style, the ruha, of the kata. The athletic performance is the strength, the speed, and the balance of the kata. One hundred and two kata on the list of WKF. So many. Massive, massive choice of kata. Massive choice. But we know that about 20 of that kata are chosen. By the, by the top athletes. Yes, yes. That because also are very difficult. is an example of how difficult it is to move from speed to standstill and then back into fast action. You just see on the shoulder of Bosin there the colours of blue. That's optional in this tournament, isn't it, Davide? The uh, athletes can choose to wear their colours on their shoulders, red or blue. Uh, so some of the athletes were will have no color at all, some will have red, some will have blue. Yes, this is the changing that WKF uh, start, start some years ago. Now most of, of the athletes has uh, the, the shoulder with the brands. Yes. The, in Tokyo will be not permitted. Just white. Just white. And a little logo on the, on the chest. Perhaps in the future you may see uh, Olympic rings, maybe. If for the Olympic champions? Yes. Possibly. Why not? Why not? Gold for the world champions? At least we will have a Olympic champion. Fantastic. So that's the scores being put in, and we'll see now the technical and athletic performance as we, on the bottom of the screen here, as the chief judge makes his way, make way across wow. to 17.92, 17.92. Technical performance, my goodness, here. This is. Oh, oh my word. And now. It's we have to go deep in the rules. Yes, look at that. That's the first time we've seen this. That's a, that's a dead tie. But 25-4-2, 25-4-2. That's an amazing we outcome. Have, we have uh, some points that was delayed. High girl for the Turkish girl. That's why Tire Solution gave us the, 